Okay, here's a quick lesson in collar stays. You know when you wear your shirt sometimes and it bends down, starts looking old and weird? Well, a collar stay actually fits in here to keep your collar straight. Make your shirt look more formal, dressable, or even just professional or just good in general. Now, a collar stay will keep that straight, but the technique to wearing the collar stay is wearing the right size of a collar stay. And I'm going to give you an example of that. There are two things to look for in a collar stay. First would be size, that it fits right, and number two would be flexibility. A lot of shirts you buy will have those collar stays already in them, but some of them will be very cheap and they'll bend and they'll just be a cheap collar stay there to kind of keep it straight while the shirt is new. And then once you get it home or wear it a week or two later, um, or second or third time, it starts bending through. So the first thing you want to do is get a collar stay that is thick and sturdy. You can buy them by themselves in a nice pack at any uh, clothing store for men. But buy some quality ones that are thick and not thin, like with paper thin. Second is the length. Sometimes people will just find a collar stay that's either too short or they'll find one that's too long. You want to find one that's the right size so when you put it in, you have that about that much room there, about half an inch left, so it's not poking into you while you wear the shirt. This is very important because some collar stays will be longer or collars will be shorter, but the collar stay will be longer and then it'll be poking into you. So the simple way is just find a collar stay, goes in nicely, sticks out just a bit, leaves you about a half an inch there at the collar, and you'll have that nice, beautiful collared look.